This tier Check one tower mid. mid lane though. Yeah, we oh. got a Fisher. Oh, it's about to connect. It actually is enough to block him on out. Nice Fisher. Long range. We pulls out the ice wall and a spirit to slow him down. And with the assistance of Nature's Prophet, it's gonna be enough to keep Dendi back. But look who's a charging home. It's gonna be Spirit Breaker. Oh, puts him right in. No oh my in the gosh! Back. It just goes to show, man. Every two minutes we could see a big engagement. Oh. Meanwhile, speaking of which, mid lane, yeah. they get a nice catch up here, and Weeha should fall. Ancient Seal's already happened, and just one more right click, and it's gonna be Dendi. Uh, definitely outgun. The him in that department. Oh, the Fissure catches right behind. Concussive shot. Is it enough power? It's not. Havo still running it down. The salve will be there in addition, but look, it's like Nature's Prophet will cancel the TP. Almost came in for a bit of reinforcements, but look at the Shrek. Oh, who me. did commit. There's Nature's Prophet. Comes in from behind. Wants to get all of Havos. Sprout's going to lock him. Sunstrike. Not going to be needed. Three because he doesn't dedicate himself to a lane. And they want to build off of that into some great dual damage, but to the duels up, that's just not going to happen. For now, he's out, he charges, down for the he count. He pinged out right there as Earthshaker does cross him and uh, Fauna immediately pulls back, but... He might be ready to fight here. No, I guess not. Sunstrike just makes another brief combo. Funic doesn't pull back in time. Uh oh. Dendi. Yep. Uh oh. Dendi on the hunt here. And Perdrino. Charge is coming in. Sprouts himself. Just as out as much right click as possible before he does go down. And now Levi's going to be on the chase. And so is Spearbreaker. Still full charge forced. And they're going to try to catch up with her. Still, it looks like. Oh, nice slow with the lightning storm. Sets up for this. Yeah, Sunstrike again. It's going to be right there. It's Weeha. It's like the Phonic, like you mentioned, he probably saw, underestimated the potential of Spirit Breaker with Invoker. Fisher will come out. They do have the Ravage. They might use it here. Weeha's got a decent bounty. He Sunstrikes himself, but a nice wow. step back there from Phonic, but the charge is still coming. He's got plenty of life. Nature's Prophet shows up with that global presence and sprouts Dendi very nicely, and Weeha is in the clear. For the time being, charging on through though is going to be your Spirit Breaker making it to go on Funnick, but Company's there, and they now turn their sights to Solitude. Solitude is he going to be sprouts. able to step away. Nice Sprout again from Nature's Prophet. Locks Dendi in. Anyone nearby, let them know. We're here, we're ready to take this tower. Levy's right there, pulls out Lightning Storm. Nice Earth Splitter does catch, or Split Earth rather, from Levy, and they take down Dendi. Just like and, that, and he bottom, the bottom river. Yeah, they get a hold of Funic with a nice spot. Let's pull up the tree. He gets one last acre smack. Back on mid lane, we might see an engagement. Dendi gets a slow off, but charging on through his Spirit Breaker right towards Earthshaker, and he quickly takes him down. It's going to be Hockey who gets it done with the long range nuke, and now Solitude. Nice little juke away from the trap right there. Oh, ultimate going to be denied from the Ancient Seal coming out from Vanscore. Bit of redemption from him. Previously being taken down in the jungle, but. Weeha here, bottom lane, the most. A little bit early damage. Fisher's going to be there. He has the no ultimate available. Weeha trying to slow. Even pulls out the ice wall here. He might get away oh, from the this cold one. Steps. Long range hit's going to be there, and Havos gets it done. Weeha starts doubling back towards the Roche pit where you see a charge coming in from Spear Breaker, but it blows him back in his face. The Reaper's sight secures the kill for Havos right there. But now jumping up through is going to be Hockey. Gets a hold of Rain here, and now Meow Meow. Can't score. Gets caught out very quickly. Dendi, big echo slam, return fire from FNG. But they're still on the hunt. Dendi real low here as Havos tries to walk away. The ice wall keeps him so low, and he sprouted up as well. He eats himself from the other side. Goes towards the, fu the Funic Smoke even to try to give a little bit of extra move speed, but it's not going to be there and available. And they're not done yet, man. They're uh -oh. going to huddle way across. They're pinging out exactly where Havost is. They're sending the Forge Spirits in and the Treants now. The scout them out the corner, but by now everyone's coming back to life. They're going to TP right back into the lane. FNG. Vigor will lock Levi. He called him Levi instead of Levy. <laughs> Tries to force that a bit of blood, but we'll pull out the TP. We'll make it on out. Nature's Prophet puts himself. We'll get another TP to make his way out. Going on right now. Like the aspect of that Evoker Funny, this almost solo pickoff on Funny, forcing him because he's running naked blink to go for the self ravage to save himself means they didn't have control over the pit. Hockey didn't get the duel. He didn't give it up either. Oh. Oh man, it just doesn't stop. Now there's a big breakout here in the bottom of the river. It's. Spirit Breaker gets caught out with a very nice Mystic Flare. Now a duel comes on the field. They take down Skyrath Mage. The duel does end, and Legion Commanders falls. They split the fight. Dendi so low, unable to get away. Oh, this damage output. Dendi's smoked up. He's going to be on the high ground here. He scouts out Spirit Breaker, and now he's going to start issuing the damage. Salty has nowhere to go. Dendi's just standing in front of him like, you're not going to make it past me, buddy. So you can't build... Uh... Bloodstone out of that one anymore, but he does go for this pipe, which was I think my second favorite option. And actually, oh, it's all too. 
They commit an Echo Slam to take down the Shrek, but Spirit Breaker's right in there to get a little bit of something back, and they do take down Skywrath Mage, but Nature's Prophet also committed for this one. Might be caught out. Sunstrike, not gonna matter as their Shaker ends up falling regardless. And there, they also managed to bring down your Spirit Breaker. Walking into a really bad spot here, a simple Cold Snap, and he's done for. He does have haste, but they have the lockdown. Yeah, they turn back, they pull off the charge for now, or Fracture's now gonna be taken down. They quickly focus fire Denny, trying to take him apart, and they will get him. Very nice grab. It's going to be Weeha who benefits from it. And those Forge Spirits, man, dishing out huge right-click damage at this point. They get the nice pickoff right there, and they take themselves towards this top lane. But Spirit Breaker, he's already onto his next target. He's charging on through. Scouts out FNG, which runs him face first into a Fissure. Negative Earning gets thrown on out, and with the rotation from Team MP, ooh, thinks about the Sprout there, but it ends up right behind the post. Gonna turn fire. Nice! Weeha catches the Sun Strike right there onto Skywrath Mage. But meanwhile, up and above, the Reaper Scythe is what's going to take out Nature's Profit. So, Padrino and Weeha combine together, take that tier two. But uh, we're going to see a huge Echo Slam off of all those Treons and Ford Spirits. Wow. He won't be forced to use his Aegis too early on unless he starts diving. Uh, he does have his Blink Blade Mail, though, and uh, some members have to be careful. Uh, if the Refraction's gone or if the BKB's not there, Necro, uh, either one of them could be in some trouble. We're going to see the Blink, the Duel. Will they be able to bring him down? They hold no, the both in place. Big Mystic Flare, but the Blade Mail fires back huge damage and takes out Skywrath Mage. Havos had already fallen with Big BK or Big Bloodstone. He'll come right back, but it's Dendi now. Bringing out huge damage to take out the LC. Dancing back is going to be your Lashrek, who has to move on forward. If he gets hit again with a big, big strike, he could go down, but... Here they go, Denny yeah, is going, going right from behind. BKB popped to prevent the Fissure, but it's not going to prevent that click. Denny cleans them up very easily. Yeah. Oh, he's stuck! The Fissure actually blocked himself <laughs> out, so... Place and he goes down. Free Aegis. And I don't think he actually gets out. Like, this is... A lot of spells being cast upon them, and yeah, they just don't have the bailout tools. That is actually <laughs> not gonna get any more on lane. Looking press on in, it's a boast. They quickly clean out Aki there on the back end of a Reaper's Scythe. He falls, but now looking to make a move as Nature's Prophet, immediate BKB, and he's gonna try to right click down at least FNG for now. They do get it, now they turn back to Havost, but Havost. He's big, he's bad, he's not beautiful as Necro, but he can get it done as he just quickly pulls out an additional heal for his allies, pressing on forward, green line with about quarter life. Can't really engage too hard at this point. Levy moves forward, Lightning Storm, trying to slow the a bit, but here they come, Funic waiting in the back lines. He's about to drop a huge Ravage Hammer if necessary. Vos, though, puts his attention towards the tower alongside with Dendi, and they're trying to stay spread. They got to know. Oh, look, look at this. From the side. This is going to be oh! from behind. Huge Ravage 1, huge Ravage 2, and it cleans out both. Immediate set of buybacks coming on out, and Solitude gets cleaned on up, even with the blade bail popped. They just turn back forward. Dendi gets out his BKB once more and starts bringing in huge right-click damage. Can he finish off Nature's Prophet? They can. With the help of Funic pushing on in, it's... BBC on their last efforts to try to stop the again. Abby from cleaning out, but all right, they charge on forward here. They get Dendi Sun Strike comes out, but it's not going to do any respectable damage. Spirit Breaker making a move on Skywrath Mage while Dendi presses forward and straight into an Ice Wall with no more BKB is susceptible to big magic damage. Skywrath Negative Earn's going to take him on out. Spirit Breaker also falls. Reaper Side takes out that Lishrek. They jump back once more and will be able to get the second set of racks and the GG call to come out. From the Balkan Bears, a very hasty and still relatively clowny matchup, but it's still not the who will come out on top. Amazing, just amazing. That, that funny Ravage, he, he actually skirted along the vision of the tower, four staff behind the tree line, and they got the perfect blink right on the Leshrac. He knew that he had to get it on him first because that was the big BKB pop. 